Well, it looks like Steve's been busy doing demolition work in the kitchen. He's got a pretty good start on filling up the trailer. And I think if I go look in the kitchen window from the driveway, I can just sort of make out the studs for the den wall are completely stripped on both sides. Let's go inside and have a look. Okay, this is the dust barricade in the den. And if we come in here, we look through, we can see kind of right through the den wall that's been demoed. I think we need to go in from the other direction and see if we can see more clearly. Okay, here's a zipper wall in the hallway. <laughs> This one's a little harder to get into. All right, let's take a look. There we go. The kitchen, the den wall has been demolished. So that's pretty interesting. Let's have a look. So that's the oven outlet right there. This is the other room. Uh, wall outlet. Uh, here's the heating pipes that go up to the upstairs bedroom. So that's interesting. I'm going to have to probably figure out something there to keep that enclosed. Here's the uh, den. This is the uh, plastic wall that keeps everything from getting the dust in the rest of the house. Here we go. We're demoed. Well, we need to demo a little more. This is just a start. We're gonna have to get a temporary wall up on either side of this before this is taken out completely. All right, we're on our way. After getting a couple hours of sleep, I got up pretty early. Through breaker number 9 and 11 on off position, took out this outlet for the stove, wanted that out of the way. Then I turned off breaker number 1 and I took this next circuit out. This controlled a uh, overhead light, a wall switch, and a floor outlet. Wanted Steve to be able to do some work today without the electrical system in his way. So this wire goes up through the ceiling to this light fixture, which we're going to take out and replace with an LED one.